Hello everyone, this is Vincent from iPhoneism.com Here with a tutorial on how to install the latest iOS 5 Beta 3 on your iPhone, iPad or iPod Touch. Need before you get on to install iOS 5 Beta 3 is the latest beta of iTunes. iTunes 10.5 Beta 3 is also available. You need to download it because it comes with support for iOS. 5 beta 3 if you have the previous beta of iTunes 10.5 it won't work and it won't restore your iOS device to beta 3 so to, to, so to restore your device to beta 3 you need the latest developer beta of iTunes 10.5 that aside what you simply need to do is that first you need to get the UDID of your device registered because you cannot uh, restore beta firmware on iOS devices that do not have their UDIDs activated. The procedure to find and get the UDID activated is given in the description down below. You can check that out. Other links are also given down below. Once you have the UDID registered, simply connect your iOS device to the computer. Launch iTunes and if you're on Mac, press the ALT key and click on restore and if you're on Windows then you press the shift key and click on restore so that's what we'll do just press the shift key and click on restore I've already downloaded the IPSW for my fourth generation iPod Touch the iOS 5 Beta 3 IPSW Download direct download links for iOS 5 Beta 3 IPSWs for all supported iOS devices are given in the description below. Just select the previously downloaded IPSW and click on open. iTunes will now show a message that is going to erase and restore your iOS device to iOS 5 and will verify this store with Apple. Click on restore. iTunes now begins to extract the software. The whole restoring process can take up to 10 minutes. So just sit back, relax and let iTunes do its work. The device at this moment should show the Apple logo. And if I can show you that right now, you can see that it's showing the Apple logo with a little status bar. So we'll be back when the restore is done. As you can see that the restore is nearly done. It's in the final stages. iTunes is just why verifying the iPod restore with Apple for the last time. Basically it's checking if the UDID is listed in the developer account or not. That's what the beta version of iTunes does it when you're trying to install beta firmware on your iOS device. We should get the notification that the restore has been done in just about a minute. iTunes has now displayed a notification which says that the iPod has been restored to factory settings. The restore to iOS 5 beta 3 was successful. The device should start in just about a minute. For your information, we at iPhoneism have been offering free UDID registrations for all of you to try out iOS 5 beta on your respected iOS devices. Link to that page is also included in the description below. Do submit your UDID in the form and Try your luck and see if you get a free UDID activation from us. And there you go, iOS 5 Beta 3 is running on 4th generation iPod Touch. To see how you set up iOS 5 PC free on the device itself, we've already covered a video below, the link to which is also included in the description. If you like this video, please rate comment, subscribe to our channel, don't forget to thumb this video, 
this is Vincent from iPhoneism.com and I hope that you like this video.